Jefferson Orboy Griggs is um, almost a mute, uh, cut off from society, doesn't have any internet, doesn't have a father, doesn't really have a family. Kind of goes from being a, a kind of almost a monkish character living on a houseboat in the middle of the desert to um, kind of a petty criminal uh, and gets involved in things that are over his head. And all of a sudden my character became left-handed because it was like, I can't use my hands. It's kind of a coming of age story, but for people that are a little older and more than that from society. I'm like, I'm not shutting this down. Preparation? To steal it? Yeah, no, I... I started ripping off 7 Eleven and stuff, uh, sneaking into movies. Um, no, I didn't, I didn't really think about the criminal aspect. I kind of just tried to think of what I would do if I had nothing else in the world. And it doesn't seem like crime, I don't think, when you, um, when you have no other way. It seems like the only thing you can do. So, um, yeah, I don't think the character sees it as, I don't think the character is even nervous or even thinking he's doing anything wrong. He's not really in touch with that part of society, and he has no other options. He's been forgotten and left behind, so what else can he do but to try to get his in life and try to move up and try to find something to do. And did you have any hesitation working with first-time directors? Yeah, that's awesome. No, I love working with first-time directors uh, because they don't know what the rules are, so it's fun to break all the rules. Uh, it's not just any gig, you know, it's like this is this is his first movie and, you know, so, yeah, I mean, he's poured his whole life into it, so, yeah. I know, it's just how pretentious I didn't even think it was in his, he's, he's, some, he's such a professional and um, knows what he's doing anyway. It doesn't even seem like that. Yeah, I think the best advice I would give a young filmmaker is to probably write a manageable script to shoot during while you're in Lou, uh, Congratulations, you can make a movie for Lou's one of my favorite friends. actors of I think all time. Because Having I went to the American I, he, a lot of he, he pushes on you to work hard because he's I've never worked with an actor that's so committed. He was like he became this he got tattoos as the actor that the character would have forever. He's got tattoos. And I was like, Oh well I gotta I gotta up my game. Um, yeah, he's a generous, generous actor. He's, um, brings the best out of you. Lou brought the best out of you. I thank him for 